Hello, welcome to the IBM Cloud App Management Series. My name is Mark Leftwich and I work for IBM SWAT Best Practice Team. Today I'm going to show you how to install FTP on a Red Hat box. A customer asked me this week which is my preferred method to move the installation media to the cluster. I tend to use FTP so I'm going to show you a quick demo. The first thing you need to do is see if you've actually got FTP installed already. The easiest way to check this is try and FTP from the command line to an FTP server. You can see the response here that FTP is not installed. The easiest way to get this installed is through yum. Using the command on screen, hit return. Yum will then go to its repositories and check if it has FTP and download it to your system. It is now asking if it's OK to download and shows you the size of the download. I'm going to select Y for yes and click return. It then downloads the packages. Once it's complete, the easiest way to check it works is try and connect to that FTP server again. As you can see, I'm now being asked for a username and password. I'm going to put in my username and my password. I'm now going to show you a few quick tips I use before I transfer installation media. The first is to set the downloads to binary by typing the word binary and clicking return. The second tip is you can set your download directory on your local system. So if you type the command lcd and then the directory you want the files to download into and hit return, it now sets that directory. If you want to look at the directory listings in the FTP server, you would type ls and you can now see what is on the FTP server. If you wish to change directory, you can use the cd command. I, in this case, want to download the agent config pack. So I'm going to do the command get, copy the name of the agent config pack, paste it in, and hit return. That is now downloaded. You can see on the bottom line how many bytes are received and what the kilobytes per second were. I hope that helps you move some of your installation media. Thank you for watching this video on IBM Cloud App Management. Be sure to check out all the other videos in the series.